The Stand Your Ground case in Clearwater continues to make national headlines. And tonight, a local man is coming forward in support of the shooter and the law. James L. Lule used the Stand Your Ground defense in his 2013 murder case. He spoke with News Channel H. Jamel Lene about spending time in jail and then being acquitted. He's living a private and quiet life right now in Frostproof. He's speaking out publicly for the first time in three years since stabbing and killing his neighbor. I don't believe the guy had any right to put his hands on the older man, knock him to the ground. James Alul sides with Michael Draca. The man who shot and killed Marquise McLaughlin nearly three weeks ago at the Circle A Food Mart in Clearwater after he was pushed to the ground. Traka says he was standing his ground. How did he know he wasn't going to get beat up more? I think everyone should be able to carry a firearm if they need to defend themselves. Alul went on trial for murder for stabbing and killing his neighbor, Gerald Lester Jr., during a noise dispute in 2013 at a mobile home park in unincorporated Pinellas County. Alul says it was self-defense after Lester attacked him. That man was killing me, and after my lung collapsed, I couldn't breathe. And thank God there was a knife on my workbench, and I grabbed it, and I used it. Alul was arrested and spent 18 months behind bars before a jury acquitted him in 2015. He blames Sheriff Bob Golteri for not turning his case over to the state attorney's office. I think he's a flip-flopper. He's made mistakes in the past. I think it's time for a new sheriff in Pinellas County. I think they owe me for 18 months of my life that were taken away. And if they take this man's life away from him, they're doing him injustice also. James says he feels the state owes him an apology. As for the shooting in Clearwater, we have no word yet on when Bernie McCabe's office will come back with a decision. In Polk County, Jamel and A, News Channel 8.